morning. Um, today, we are going to be dealing with <clears throat> Paraduma, and that's what we're learning. And we're going to deal with a couple of halachas, specifically relating to Esachadas. Ramam Elchas Paradum Perik Yud, Halach Beis, describes the following. Memala Odom Mayim, a person can fill water, which is the water for the Paraduma, the Mayim Chaim. Umenichan Etzle Malay Kiddush, Kozman Shir. So you can leave him as long as he wants. And there is no, and this is not considered, um, this is not considered Heschadas, even though he's, I mean, there's no way in the world that he's constantly monitoring them. But so the way, and then he goes on to describe. He can take it around and then he can put a fair on it. Anytime he wants. That's water before Kiddush. Even the ones that are whole, uh, have already been made holy. Yeah, you can use him whenever he wants. Okay. Says the Ravid, the Aim Bekach Klum, or the Ravim says, it doesn't matter, but the Ravid has, as long as they're protected. There shouldn't be a dinner of Hesachadas. What that means, protected, generally they're not. They're not in a position. I, I, it doesn't mean you have to sit and think about them. It's not the Hesachadas of Ilkhus Tilm. It's the Hesachadas of Shmira. Halacha Dalit, two halachas later. The Rambam says the following Somebody takes water to make them into my may may khatos which is to make them holy and so akhlay min mayim shen nis katshu and you're traveling with them and they're in a some kind of a container la yafshil akli la khayrov don't carry the the vessel that they're in on your back when you show on your on their back. El Olofanov, only in front of you. Why? Shinema Limish Meres Lime Nido. Baha Bizman Shahain Shmurin Hain Me Nido Vim Lapsu. When they're guarded, they're me nida. Not so. However, me lost a chavis. Let's say he's got two barrels of water, two jugs or two uh two two containers of water. So there he can't carry them both in the front. It doesn't work. So nice and achas lefonov and achas lacher mishi mitne she e f shar. But you can't, there's nothing you can do about it. So in other words, when you could do something about it, you must. You can't, you can't, too bad. That, that would be the simple reading, obviously. We're going to find out. It's not so posh. Because obviously it's a question. Well, <laughs> if it's Shama or Jama, not not. <clears throat> so the Ravid here says, I don't understand what he's talking about. Melachet only passes Hesachadas because it's Hesachadas. When you do some Melacha along with what you're taking care of the of the Mechatas, 
And yet, it says clearly that the only time the lock apostles is until you made it holy. Once you made it holy, it doesn't make it apostle. Uh, and we're talking about water that's already been turned into mechatos. Um, now, where does he get this from? The Raven, the Mishnah and Para, Peri Dalit, Mishnah Dalit, Hamalacha Pesel is Ma'atra Teyosa Efer, Hamalacha Pesel is Ma'atra Yatilu Asa till you turn it into Mechatos. <coughs> now, here's a Mishnah is there that Amam is beautifully talking about. Malacha. And he ends up like this. Am Rushab. He brings a. We're going to talk about this, uh, this, this, this drush uh, later. A yochel kitsche that even if it gets possible when it becomes kadosh, Tam and Lemon may need the kvar. Hey, may need as a malacha claim a sheein and nipsel a malacha will cause man shachesh of all of last days may need it. Last days may need it when he's making it a may need it when he's making it mechatas. Tam and Lemon can ask him any the ein and nipsel a malacha. Akabanim. You have the Ravid's question on the Rambam. It's a, it, 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 it's mainly, it's only it mainly that doesn't get possible. The Malach. So the Kesemishna says this is a ongoing argument between the Ravid and the Rambam. The Rambam holds. That they are two separate things, Malacha and Hesachadas. And the Raivin holds it the same thing, and that is in, in Perig Zayin Alocha Alav. The Rambam says, "I'm Alocha Pesel's in my kind of Shiris Gatshri." Brings us Alocha that we that the Raivin refers to. Vayne Pesel's by Zoh. Malacha will only pass before it's holy, and he says this is different Kabbalah. And then he goes into saying that right. As he said in the Pirish Mishnayis. And there he writes. <coughs> so, it's, it's all about Malacha being Paisal only during that time. Comes along the Raivid and says, There's no Malacha, it's all Hashanahs. Shahu Shayr Spisal Amalacha. So, we have an ongoing machlekes. Rambam separates Malacha from Hesachadas, the Haivit, puts them together. Reb Chaim, in Chidusha Agrach, which is not really um, his writings, but his shirim, in Mesechtas Parah, there, asks, He says, "Yeah, you're right. Okay, you got you got, you got me there." The right, he says about the Kesemish. It's but it's too it's too dim. It's <clears> Hashanas. <throat> it's Malach going around. But where they learn it from? From the same Basik. The Shmeres the Maynida. So make up your mind. Does it mean before or after? <laughs> if it means all, always or before, and if it means before, it means before. If it's after, it's after. So what, what, what's going on here? How can one be before, one be after? Very strong question. So he comes up with a with, with a very interesting approach. Uh, <clears throat> Even though he says Mishmeris Lamedida is not talking about Mayim before Kiddush. It's only, I'm saying it's only going on mine before Kiddush, but Hesradas will pay will pass because of the Afer. Well, Melacha is a special dinner, it doesn't pass away. And that's what I'm saying. It's, it's not because of the Mayim, it's because of the Afer. It's, 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 it's an interesting Lush. An interesting Kiddush, whether it fits in the Rama, not so much because he bases it on Agro and Yuma. Not everybody learns to grow the way that Ramam learns, the way Chaim learns them. So, but it's an approach. <clears throat> okay. So let us spend some time here evaluating what's going on here. 
First of all, we have this the Rebbeim's question. So it's it's a, it's a very strong question. How do you learn two things from the same pasuk and say one of them is only till kiddush and one is after kiddush? That would be the Rambam's approach according to the Kesemish. The second question, which we already alluded to, let's just analyze a little bit more of this halach. In that Mishnah where it says that if somebody has two barrels, one he puts in front, one he puts in back. So the Mishnah, the way we have the version, it says, Mnei she'i efshar. Right? However, the Bartanura there, the Rav, is Geiris Mnei she'efshar. And this is what he explains. Since you are anyway guarding the front, you can guard the back. In other words, when it's only in the back, you forget about it. When you have your back, you don't, you, you, you know, you don't, you don't have your back. <laughs> Somebody else might have it, but you don't have it. Whereas if you're carrying part of it in the front right, and there's something in the back, the fact that you're concentrating on the front, you'll remember the back. In the Sefer Meiser and Keach on the Rambam, he asks the question, <laughs> what's the EF? What kind of answer is that? If there's a din that you have to have, that Eschadaz is Pesel, so Eschadaz is Pesel. Well, what kind of EF is there? So the 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 Pnei Nachim, who has the Oris on the Rambam, that were printed, wants to compare it to Ilke Shabbos and say, first of all, he has a problem with this whole aloha. Putting in the back is no good. Why? In Hilcha Shabbos, we say that there is a shmir, just a shmir, pachusa. If you intend to carry in the back, it's considered shamor. If you intend it in the front and it went to the back, that's a problem because it was a shmir mula going to shmir pachusa. And then he wants to say that Shabbos and Pura are not the same together. They're not the same concept. <clears throat> The Rash is Geirus like the Ramah, the EF Shem, right? The Ramah clearly says that. And he says, Av al Gav, he explains that law. The La'ach of Nami Shmiri, be the Master of Shesh Hadid. Why? If it's good, obviously it's a Shmiri. I could be with this with this Maran Shabbos that it is a shmir. So he says an interesting word which doesn't look here. It has to be explained. Since I could do a better shmir, that look here, that's what he's saying. What, what kind of smart is that? I'm not sure. If, if this is enough for shmir, it's enough for shmir. <laughs> if it's not enough for shmir, it should be enough for shmir this way. He, he doesn't hold like the Ram that because I'm being shamer already. What of sure. He's not saying that sorry. Doesn't say Misha Nish Efsha. Nish Efsha. But 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 he's saying something. Uh, but not for shame with Zuck, but that's what he's saying. Uh, now this halacha we said before that malacha is only pesel before Niskatu. We learn out from my apostle Rashi's Chukas the Supri says. Why does it say that possible? So if I say maybe I feel a kid, should have a limeida. Once they may need they don't become possible. So the Zivri learns that the soul of Malacha is the making of Meinida. Once it's Meinida, when it's Meichatas, it doesn't... It, 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 and he learns from the Lama, live Meinida. <clears throat> now, the Halacha the haloch of carrying behind you, why it's good? Why it's... It, why, it carry, why carrying behind you is no good because it has Chabas? So the Gemara learns that out. Also, the same word. <laughs> Which the Rambam in 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 Pirushamishnai elaborated on, but the point is, without when you don't watch them, they're Oish Menida. 
So here we focus on the limb may need. Here we focus on the shmur may need. This makes it makes your kindness question even stronger. <clears throat> now, why does the Rambam use this uh, flowery lotion? Kishem shmur and amrei may need. The Rambam writes psul and you should make shayim. He writes the other way, you know, you should contrast them the same words. Okay, I want to suggest something based on something that I saw with the following introduction. I'm going to sidetrack for a moment just to come back. In Ilkhis Ovel, Herik Yudalin, Halach Yudalin. The Raman writes that if somebody's carrying a, a dead person from one place to the other, don't carry him like a sack and put him on a donkey and ride on the donkey or on the bones. Because it's a bizarre. If he's afraid to carry it because there are thieves and who might want to ransom the body or list him or uh, other types of thieves, but then it's okay. Now, in he'll just say for Terry, there's a similar halach. Very cute halach. Someone's going from one place to the other and he has a safe Terry. Don't put it into a sack and ride on the the same thing. Don't ride on it. If you're afraid from Ganav, it's mutter. If you're not afraid, what should you do? You carry it connected Libai and you ride on the animal and go. <clears throat> in other words, it is as an additional Allah, which doesn't say in Hilchis Oven that you should carry it in front of you. There it just says, don't, don't put it on the donkey and walk and ride on top of it. The Lechem Mishnah there in Hilchas Avil is Medayik. That is a difference between the Sefer Torah and a dead body. That Sefer Torah you cannot put in the back of you. You have to put it in front of you, again against your your heart. Whereas a or as a um, uh, 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 that person you can carry in the back. No, 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 and the Sefer is in Sefer Terry, there's a bit of covered. As it says, Sefer Terry, Kosha, Nay, the Mikadushi, Sefer, the covered Godel. And then it says that if you sit in front of the Sefer Terry, you have to sit in the Kaven, Reish, the Aim, the Pacha. And he says, There's a bit of covered in Sefer Terry. So he wants to say, and that is the source. Of the halacha of the chiv of shmir by Sefer Torah, and not letting it go in the back because it lacks in covet. And he says that this is similar to the halacha of paradim. That if somebody is carrying one, doesn't put it in the back. And there he writes the laws. The gemara down says shmurei menidim lapsu. Okay. I'm, not, I'm just using this idea that we see a concept here, that perhaps the din that the Torah requires by <clears throat> by mechatos to carry it in the front <clears throat> is a din and covet. You have to conduct yourself in a respectful way. Now, the Shvimur is, is, is an act of respect. An act of respect. Oh. Um, 
Malacha is nothing to respect. Malacha did. If that's the case, we can understand in a certain sense that there's a major difference between the two. That Malacha has to do with creating the Mechatas. COVID is even more so if it's Mechatas. And that's Loshan, it's a Kavachaymer. And that's why the Ein Tzaruch Leimah Mayim Shin is Katshu, Losh Narama. For sure. You have to guard it because you're going to have to give it honor. You have to give it a certain respect. Yeah, conduct yourself in a respectful manner. To it. And that's what it means. Bizman Shehei Shmur and Hei Menida. That's why he writes that Losh. This is, this is the way you conduct yourself with Menida. And therefore, if you don't, you take away its 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 value, and therefore it's possible. You have lost its honor, its 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 status. Maybe that's what the rash means. It's very long to the words the rash. But he says, even though Achrav there's a shmira, it's definitely considered guarded. But if you could have done it in the front, you don't do it. It's possible. Why? Obviously, I'm not giving it the proper reset. Since it can be done more and you don't, the shmir will, not just shmir will, it could be, it, it takes away that you're not conducting yourself with the proper covenant for many either. And therefore, you 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 take away its status of many either. And that's the gear of EF. If you have no choice, and that's covenant. That's why choice is an issue. If you have no choice, that's covenant. You have choice and finish. Then you're then you have to give it the right honor. And that will answer also the question that Abraham has on the Kesem Mishnah. The, the, they're both because, because of the same possible. But they're coming from a different angle totally. One is an angle of that, that has to do with, with the essence of making it many the one is the end of COVID. COVID, I can't. So it's all about they need the one is, is not shy. The, 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 the one is many. The why would it be Malachi based? The one is many. But COVID, I can't. That, that, that is a Kalachim. Again, it doesn't say anywhere other than from this. But the fact that we find this connection, the Tefetera. And and the, uh, to 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 mechatas, it gives us room to 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 learn it like that, and it also makes it a lot makes a lot of sense if it would be it would be true, and uh, it would come out very good. Why there would be a difference in two? So in other words, the hesachadas is 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 a, is a din of shimur is not just shimur, it's shimur to have the proper conduct for many for mechatas. Anyways, I use it in the start. Aslach Rabba, be well.